Pivots for Fisichella, the current leader, and, and then Michael goes to the inside, tries to block the line in 130. Oh, my word! And Alonso having none of it, straight. Just look at this, and disbelief. Yeah, Michael then is uh, crimped up on the inside, nothing he can do. Alonso just nails and things. I know he'll, he'll have to live. Again, he goes defensive when he doesn't need to. It puts him out of shape then for the exit then, as we saw earlier on. Has he got enough traction? to keep the McLaren behind him. He's really left himself to be a sitting target now. He'll have to go defensive down the inside. He'll have to go tighter than that. Oh, and they nearly touch. Can Raikkonen sweep in? Yes, yes! brilliant. What a brilliant move. Side by side down the straight. He started from 17th place. But again, he got it all wrong at the top chicane by just compromising his exit. And then, as I said, he was always going to be a sitting target down the pit straight. Brilliant stuff from Raikkonen. Absolutely sensational. Kimi Raikkonen then heading for his 10th Grand Prix victory. The seventh of this season. And what a year he has had. And what an amazing Japanese Grand Prix he has had as well. Fighting his way through. We seen, it seemed as though he lost his chance when he got tucked up behind Jensen Button and Mark Webber. And Fisichella had a 20 second advantage over him but he's managed to whittle it down. Brilliant strategy this afternoon by the McLaren team. And here he comes then. Oh, Takuma Sato there has caused a few problems this afternoon, but not as uh, Raikkonen sweeps through to lap him. And one of the most dramatic Grand Prix in living memory comes to a close with Kimi Raikkonen, the winner! Absolutely sensational performance. In second place will be Giancarlo Fisichella.